Two local colleges are now answering questions from students and their families about their safety as they head back to school. The Valley Today's Brian Sherrod has more on what to expect as we uh, get close to students heading back to class. Good morning, Brian. Good morning, Jordan and Lisa. You know, the uncertain times because of COVID-19 was making it harder when it comes to just living in this world as we know it. But when it comes to the certainties that they do have for going back to campus, you know, schools feel pretty prepared when it comes to that for the safety of their students and their staff. Now, starting with Minnesota State University, their 12 page return to campus plan has been broken down into six categories. To break this down further, everyone on campus is required to wear a mask. Soap screening services will be placed at entrances, classrooms and labs. If students happen to be positive with COVID-19, they will work directly with the Dean of Students Office to get their absences approved, notify employees, and coordinate support services. Staff says they are still planning to reopen their offices, departments, and programs before or on August 17th. Now over to the University of North Dakota, they will have a primary entrance and exit, provide hand sanitizer and wet wipe stations, signs will be displayed to limit hallway congestion and crowding. In classroom settings, staff will be physically distanced behind a marked area and plexiglass shield. I am still researching their start date and will update once we have it. So the Q&A is set for 6 p.m. over Zoom tonight. You can go on Facebook to attend the meeting, and if you happen to miss it, there will be pre-recordings on their websites as well, and we'll have a link to it on our website as well. Some important information as we all look to stay safe this fall. Brian Sherrod reporting live. Thank you.